Yo, them say we know they do nothing. Yeah, 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 but them they like our thing. Yo, man, if you don't know this boy, Article 1, aka Nye Nye. Keep watching, you don't know, Charlie. If you don't subscribe, I beg, go subscribe to your Kasa TV. Charlie, follow them, link up. Me, where I talk, say, fan them. Link up. addressing a number of issues beginning from what happened on the night of the music awards um i mean i don't even know where to start or how to start but i'll keep it very short i am a musician and my brother chatawale is a musician as well most importantly we all do the same genre of music you know so whatever we do however we do it we are brothers, even if we like it or not. And then over the period of, over, over the years, we have all witnessed the friction and the rivalry that has been in our music industry, so to say. Knowing also that the media, the Ghanaian media that we have, I mean, thrive on such news and such headlines to to grow, which is no lie, and we have to call a spade a spade. So many a time we have felt, you know, the punch from each other, either by what we heard, what somebody said, maybe something I said that I wouldn't mean it, maybe something that he said I wouldn't mean it. We all know the environment in which we are. So to keep a long story short, you know, we came We've come a very long way, you know, representing for Ghana, myself, he's done so many amazing things on the days of Bandana, rebranded to Shatawale, and has pushed. Um, to be honest, we all have individual ways of doing our things and approaching stuff. I, as an industry player, I will respect other people's modes of operation and therefore have accorded maximum amount of respect to every other artist in the country and I'm sure that he also has, you know, in his best of knowledge, been able to accord respect to people. But we also what happened on the night, which is not the main reason why we're here. The main reason why we're here, to be honest, is for peace, for love. Look at this, you know. And when we see each other together like this, we all should know that the future is brighter. And whatever there be, we have buried. You know, whatever the hatchet be, we have buried it. We have drowned every unnecessary stuff, you know, to move forward because we've always known it. But by the turnout of events, we get to realize the importance of unity, the importance of coming together as a united force in our individual ways. You know what I mean? So, this is the main reason why we are here seated today, you know, to say the peace conference, which is very important because the youth of Ghana actually love us and we drive the youth of Ghana, hands down. Shata and Stormboy drive the youth of Ghana home and abroad, not only in Accra or Kumasi or whatever. So what is the best way? How else can we get this going without all these unnecessary feel that the media benefits from, unnecessary feel that somebody at home benefits from. Somebody, for instance, somebody will see me in town and say something, I'm like, wow, so this is what you expect me to do, but you don't know the outcome, the consequences. So I actually see that we now have to put everything aside to address these people, to direct them and not allow them to direct us, you know? 
So this is how short I want to keep it. And I'll again say sorry and apologize, you know, for the roles that we have played, you know, in making this happen. Because regardless, I'm a man of peace, he's a man of peace, as far as I'm concerned. And today we're here standing for peace for Ghana. And we pray that the word of peace will be taken to the world as far as and beyond the point where the fracas got to. So we want this to be pushed to the BBCs, to the Al Jazeera's, to know that yes, these two people are together now, like they've always wished to be, to grow the industry of Ghana against other African countries and put the name of Ghana first because it's Ghana first, you know? So thank you very much. That's what I have to say. I was really very happy. I think my brother said, oh, but, uh, um, I was about to say, but uh, basically, like he said, um, um, yeah, we just want to apologize to, you know, all who felt bad, you know, to my Beam Nation fans, to my Shutter Movement fans, you know, to my personal friends in the media, to my sweet people, you know, in the media. I just like to say, um, it always happens, and you know, like you said, you know, peace is what we all want, and we all want to get our business flourishing, you know, live a good life. And it's an example we're setting for the next generation to come, so people should just, you know, understand this. And I know most people saw our pictures and they were like, no, that's Photoshop, that's what you know, Photoshop, I mean. <laughs> but I believe you're seeing the real video, and it's just nice, so. Oh, I didn't like If you photo like it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, can we talk for them, please? Okay, so the most important point to take from what the both uh, gentlemen have said is that there is a Unity concert that is coming up, and that Unity concert will see the two of them performing hit by hit to their teeming fans from all over the country and that's coming up. Do you both want to touch on it more, Shatawali? Um, I think my brother knows about it more, so I think he can. <laughs> this one here, you know about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, start, make a finish. <laughs> oh, Charlie, it's really there. Make, oh, make a put your Facebook live. That will be where you feel free. <laughs> 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 I think that will be where you put your face. <laughs> you know what well, it's true um, we, we're planning to get you know something like that and can uh, see uh, you know Kofi Aban foundation and uh, we're really working hard towards this and I think he's one person who really sat us down and you know spoke to us about you know how we can move business so we are seeing it from the business side of life and people should just watch out for a great concert, something to portray peace, something to promote Ghana, something to sell Ghana. And you know, as I said, you know, Ghana first is our newborn baby that we try to, you know, nurture and it's gonna grow and we want the next generations upon next generations to come to really follow it up and yeah, it's gonna be a great thing. And I, I want, you know, the media to also support us because I, I believe we've been, you know, here and there, you know, Stone Boy, Shatawale, Stone Boy, but this is the time that we believe with our hands joined together we can be able to move Ghana forward. So, yes, the concert is coming up and you know, you're gonna enjoy something nice. You know how we do it, you know. This time, too, you know, we say, we're yeah. here. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, thank you. Um, uh, me, I'm gonna go back small and I'll come join because a lot of people have actually made this possible. Someone has here. Yeah, we're not gonna be here and not give thanks to some people who have at least added a word or two. Even those people who would sleep at home and wish that Shata and Stoneboy came together to push the industry. Those people also made it possible for that to be for us to be here today. Because by their wishes that they send it to the universe, God hears it. And even us ourselves. You know, we have been willing and always been willing, you know, but like he, he said, there has to, and you know, we need all forms of 
all other arms to be operational to make this happen. And that's why the Dr. Kofi Annan Foundation actually presented itself, you know, to, to play the role of that other arm to make sure that it comes to reality. But I do not want the media to feel like for such and such reasons only is a reason why we see the need to come here and engage with people to talk to you because we have ulterior motives. I do want to address that so that from the horse's own mouth, you guys will hear. We have been yearning for peace for a long time because in freedom, creativity thrives. You know what I mean? And in peace, we all feel at ease to work. So thanks to the police force, you know, especially um, the Mediana Medita, ACP, 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 Yaku, the, the Jupu. She's been a mother and a big sister to us. And can I throw a secret? You guys would have seen a picture of us from time. But you know, tensions have to die down so that we don't blend things up and all of that. So, you know, thanks to her, thanks to the yeah, original commander, commander the Mr. Christian, Christian Fury. Fury, and then the um, DSP Mohammed. Uh -huh. You know, I, I think the regional um, uh, uh, command, command, yeah, really um, helped us. You know, yes, uh, they, they they started um, talking to us before. Yes, and thanks to the other small small places to a now I'm sick of no worry. Uh, so thanks to everybody, everybody the, I want to I, I want to reiterate something that see the law actually works. You know what I mean? And then the police force are doing their best each and every day to make things work. And yesterday the president said in Canada in addressing the rain stuff. He said one point that I also was, I, I mean, we were discussing that our attitudes, our attitudes actually matter. So definitely we need to change our attitudes to us people, you know, to make sure that the police can work, the law can work, and we're all living what? Peace and harmony. So first and foremost, there's gonna be a concert and date. It's going to be announced soon. And I will not leave here by, by not acknowledging Bullet, our own brother, Forget about rough, rough town, rough town. <laughs> bullet our brother. He's well, when did she? When did she? When did she? Yeah. <laughs> He's also been around, doctor. Um, <laughs> but I'm not gay. This a no disrespect. Jesus is. Yeah. He, he's also been a brother to doctor Kofi Aban. So them also have pushed this man. To realize that he has to go and hustle to be able to make this event happen. So just on that side, we have to acknowledge that. So definitely, and Anaba also, you know, say she did tweet, she did, she gets she's, she's, like, she's bringing up so much of friends, so, so much support. Yeah. Not to say that the other people haven't been, but these are the people who have actually spent time and energy and left their jobs to come and make sure that look, let's capitalize and turn things around because people would think that. Africa and Kebe Kumo. So our big big nation is me, I'll be big to the core. Me, I'll be fan of myself, self. <laughs> so we love ourselves as much as you guys love us. You understand? But the fight and the this thing there, definitely it be natural. Things will come, but we have to understand it differently and make sure that at the end of the day, it will grow us or it will benefit us or it will put us in a good light. You understand? Because the negative, you know, they help. It may let many things know the feet. Sorry for the masses of the kind of pigeons. They don't better as here. We are local people. So. We are international people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we are local and international, so we can blend it. Sometimes I forget. Mm -hmm. So at the back, we want that this press conference will reach the farthest end of the world because it doesn't take it doesn't take a widow's might to bring these mighty names into this room. And we're proud to come from Ghana and our Ghanaians and are willing to continue to do the most for Mother Ghana in peace. So media, please help us. Don't be crashing our heads. Eh? The headlines sometimes, when I read them, I'm not saying, ah! they are starting to think plan B. 
<laughs> it's whether he knows it. You know, let me just add something to it too. It's nice, but um, I believe most bloggers are in here, most media people are in here. I believe this is the time for us to start a new business. This is the time for us to open a new venture. If you want us to beef, please, let's have a meeting, like here, this nice, <laughs> so that we'll plan it, so that the next time it won't be, you know, elsewhere, you know, people will be reading negatively. We can all make money when we come together, but if we stay in our solo rooms and solo places and feel like we can just put up headlines, we won't make money. So I beg you, me, the money is my problem. So let us go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the concept will be known as Ghana First, yeah. uh, the Shatta and Bim Nation coming together for that particular concept. So it's Ghana First, like Ghana not F-E-S-T, first. first. So I hope we're, we're Ghana for. That's right. Yeah.